Good morning. For the third day at the Yorkshire and Camper Fan Show. No. Oh, okay. Good morning <laughs> from the Yorkshire Motorhome and Camper Van Show, <laughs> 2021. I've been here three days and I still don't know. <laughs> we are exhausted, aren't we? Yeah. Really yeah. struggled to get out of bed this morning. Yeah. It's taking it out of us, but it's the last day. We're going to enjoy it. Yeah, we're going to enjoy it. We've got lots to do, lots, and we want, yeah. <laughs> Can I just point out? What? You're looking beautiful today, Mazzy. Oh, thank you. In your sunglasses. Yeah, they're my new ones, because my old ones broke yesterday and you have to fix them. These are quite me. special, these sunglasses. Oh, would, you, would you like to explain to everyone why? <laughs> these actually belong to Katie Pry. She wore these for her launch of the Day 22. She, she actually wore these and I got them bought for me for my birthday. So these were Katie Price's. She's had them on. Katie Price has had them on her head. <laughs> for and her launch, yeah. on a tattoo here. Katie Price's boyfriend. No, her ex-husband. Andre, Andre actually drew that on her and she had it tattooed on. Yeah. How can anyone know, be a fan of, of them two? Right, let's go enjoy this show. Last <laughs> yeah. day. It's actually freezing at the moment, but yes. it's gonna be red hot in a bit. Yeah. It's just a bit of mist. Slight hiccup. I've forgotten my mask. <laughs> so we're just gonna wait for Dan. He's run back to the van for me. Bless you, thank you, babe. So first thing this morning, we're going to check out our own awning. <laughs> Not ours. <laughs> I just want to see if they've done anything different to how we do it. No. It's the exact same, isn't it? All these are slack. I was wondering how they took the things, but they haven't really done anything different to what no. we do. Exactly the same. Exactly the same, yeah. A bit cleaner. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ours is getting mucky. I'll tell you what we've got a problem with at the moment. What's that, honey? You get a lot of flies on here. Yeah. And when you zip this up, they get stuck behind yeah. there. Yeah. And they all, in oh, fact, really? there's a few in here now. They all they gather up there. Gather in there. there. Oh, I'll have to get like a paintbrush and drive. We need, to, we need drive. a vacuum cleaner. Oh, yeah, yeah. Get yeah, I never thought of that. I've got a running horse, so I'll turn that off. <laughs> this one caught our eye. It's yeah. stu stupidly big. From the front, I mean, I'm guessing, I don't know if this one's for sale, so I'm not going in. It might be, I don't know. But from the front, it looks wonderful. But if you see from the side, the tunnel itself, actually, massive. it's massive. Absolutely a lot of space wasted there. Well, that's a cute one, isn't it? Quite like this. I think this would have been a better size for us. Yeah. I think yeah. that would have got on a standard pitch. Yeah. Although we've not been refused to put our awning up yet. No. It is officially too big for standard pitch sizes. Yeah. So um, bear that in mind. Like the cam the camp the, the campsite we're on at the moment is Camping and Caravanning Club and their standard pitches yeah. are five metres. They're, they're never bigger. Yeah. And there's no way we could get it on that. No. She said you can you can put an awning up but don't put it on the grass, didn't she, when we yeah, arrived. We, only had we weren't going to anywhere. For a chair. <laughs> yeah. Let's be honest, yeah. we did. So again, that's our one. Just bear that in mind when buying these awnings. They won't tell you when you're going to buy them. But we love it. Yeah, we, <laughs> we do, do love, love it. it. Yeah. And whatever you do, folks, don't put that on your carpets wet. Take out the excess on the side of the bucket or a bowl. And all you do, is simply keep it flat. And as you rock it, you'll drive the solution through the stain and professional cleaning guaranteed every single time. Well, let's be honest, we all have accidents. Red wine, beer, tea, coffee, the dog's had a sh... <laughs> that kind of mania that spills beer. <laughs> it's an old stain, watch this. Place it on neat, now I don't wear gloves. No bleachers, there are no caustics, there are no sodas. Unless I have a magic finger, that's the best stain remover you're gonna use. But look, for a big area, all we need is a bowl. And in that bowl, one big cup of warm water, three capfuls, a USR. So guys, one bottle will dilute to 20 bottles. So it makes a lot of sense for keeping weight down in your motorhome, all right? Use it on your ovens, your grills, your cookers, your hobs, your pots, your pans. The only place you can't use it is polished wood. Now watch this. Place it in the bowl, bounce it up and down. The foam will come to life. Now the foam is what cleans the carpets. Now don't put that on your carpets wet. Now a little tip for you, obviously in your motorhome or caravan you're in a small area. So you want to use it quite quick. So if you want to get all the water out, you've got two foam rollers there. Just simply press them down 
and all that liquid will come out. And as the liquid comes out, what it does is the foam is what cleans the carpets. Now this carpet's got oil on, and I clean down here with a bit of vanish. Keep it flat and rock it. And as you rock it, professional cleaning guarantee every single time. Now the thing is, how much is it? Where do we get it and where do we buy it? You don't want to buy one off me, it's not a problem. You buy it on the telly, we're on QBC, the shopping channel. And on the telly what we do, we give you an applicator, we give you a handle, we give you a bottle, and on the telly we charge you for that the normal price of $29.99. But of course on the telly you buy with confidence. If it doesn't work, send it back, you get your money back. Today they're not $29.99. We knock you a tenner off. You've got it, $19.99, another bottle. For your penny change, another bottle. For seeing as we're in <laughs> Harrogate, seeing as it's fantastic sa uh, Super Sunday, seeing as it's the bank holiday, and seeing as I've never ever seen so many upset, miserable faces in all my bloody life, <laughs> Masks upwards. Go on. For the first two people that say yes, one yes, two yes, three no, £20. Go on. We'll throw you another bottle in as well. Let's get the whole lot for £20. £20 they are, folks. Cash or car. Aww. And it's as easy as sweeping up I'll just in the get kitchen. You a... They're £20 for the whole you know them little, jolly. Um... What? what do you call I'll them? I'll serve you now, you've got one of those, 20 pounds. They them little scrubbers the with the Velcro on the back or whatever. Your carpets. You know what I mean? It's like a little sponge with a green bit on the other side. Oh, my kitchen sponge? Yeah, I'll get you a pack of them, 80 pence. And you can do it. So it'll save me time. I'll find it a lot easier and it'll save me. £19.20. But it does look a good product. It did look good. The, the, the only trouble with me now is giving three or four bottles. I wouldn't want three or four in the van. No. <laughs> a lot of weight. If you sold them singly, I probably would have tried that. You were giving them away, not selling them. <laughs> Looking for something a bit more upmarket. Mm. Well, this one caught our eye. I don't know why. Caught our eye? <laughs> Can't not catch your eye. It's massive. We'll show you in a minute one particular feature on this. Um, Cathago. Wow. On a Mercedes. One year old. A lot of money. 145,000 pounds. Wow. Let's go on, let's show them the garage. It is ridiculously big. Oh, it's huge. We could actually park our motorhome in there, it's that big. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't that like is... how the door opens though. Yeah. You wouldn't be able to have anything parked near you, would you? Yeah. That's a massive, good. Six foot, seven foot comes out. That is out. a bedroom, innit? I mean, look at me compared to this. And you've got loads of storage e bits under yeah. there as well. Yeah, look at this. Very nice. I think if you want to add one this size, you'd want a few shelves or something, wouldn't you? Cause... Well, you have under them, has it? No, I mean, like, I don't know. <laughs> Stop complaining. I wonder if this You're not is getting heavy. one. <laughs> Should you have a look at this? There it is. If you want to know exactly what it is, this is camperuk.co.uk. We're selling this one. Four bear. Oh, it smells beautiful. Okay, it's one of these, what I call. Oh, grand. <laughs> oh, yeah, I know what you mean. A then. class or whatever they're calling them. The dash. Yeah, that's quite nice, isn't that is it? smart, isn't it? What Very are these nice. up here, look? Oh, look, you've got like antique clock, thermometer. And barometer, is it a barometer when it tells you the weather change? <laughs> Probably. This is your drop down. Yeah, let's have a little look around. I don't Can like I leather really seats you, like though. this. I'll look be at honest. the detail on these seats. Yeah, that's very nice. <laughs> that is right, posh, isn't it? Oh, look. Got loads of. Oh, you shouldn't give your passenger buttons. Yeah. They only cause problems and divorces. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, I, I do like the cream and white look. This is nice. I love the curves oh, yeah, on the drawers. All the way around, that's yeah. lovely. Let's just open one. I can't open it. I'm useless at anything like this, mate. I'm not going to break it. <laughs> or that one. <laughs> no, I'm not breaking them. Let someone else do it. Um, again, Mazzy wouldn't get in there too high. Oh, lovely shower. Oh, it it's got like a oh, yeah. brickwork wallpaper on it. Very nice. That's really... Oh no, what's this then? 
Oh, you've got, I don't know, it must be like a power shower or something in there. Wow. As well as a shower. Yeah, that's unusual. Uh, no it. privacy, by the way, when you're having a shower. You've got your wine rack. Oh. I don't know how to open these, actually. Very no, nice. I better not touch it. I think you have to earn a certain amount of money per year to be able to open these drawers. <laughs> I think they give you a code um, when, you, when you get in that elite group. Mm -hmm. Oh, the toilet, Mazzy. Oh my god. Oh, look, can I peek round? Oh, it's incredible. Oh, have a look in there, Mazzy, you'll fall in love with it. Oh. I can't even open one. I can't do anything. One glass of what? No, they haven't locked. That is amazing. Big wardrobe. Yeah, that this is, is lovely. Really nice. Even up here, just the detail up here. Little shelves up there. Yeah, in love with this one. I just want to show a special feature. We watched Bob and Jenny's yesterday, didn't we, when they're at the show? Yeah, I didn't know this. No, we didn't know this. But apparently, when you take this off, this one has it, and it turns into a shelf. I Never knew that. that. No, I didn't. <laughs> Very good. I wonder if ours does that. Nah. No, we don't have that. But yeah, I've learnt something new. Right. Come on, get to something cheaper. Get to Gorilla Glue stand. I'll buy you some. <laughs> this is cheap. Okay, we're going down one. This is about, I don't know, £100,000. Yeah, £98,655. Another Cafargo. A more manageable size for the likes of us. Lightweight. I don't believe that for a second. But again, let's check out the garage in this. It's another big one, but it opens better than the other. huge, isn't it? Look at the door. Can we just look at the really? By the time you filled that up, you 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 wouldn't be able to move it. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Oh yeah, I do like this. It's like a non-slip. Sea Tora is what it's called. There's all your details. If you want to have a quick read. I've seen something I've never seen before, Mazzy. Me neither, and I knew you'd like this. Come on, take me in, take me in, take me in. <laughs> Look at this. Three seats. And they all kind of swing oh, around. Beautiful seats. Oh, yeah. I'm liking that a lot. This is Two, really good. Yeah. It's that bloody, sorry to swear, it's that eight, ten foot at the front before the windscreen, I don't like. It does still seem a waste of space. Beautiful. You literally could have like a whole lovely Hello, family in there. Yeah, Hello. and you've got a big seat here. Oh, lovely. Thank you. Very nice. <laughs> and then you've got this we have, uh, just filming. <laughs> beautiful cream kitchen. Same bed again, not keen on this style, but... You've got them in the corner again. It is just like a cheaper, £50,000 cheaper version of the other one. Smaller. Okay. Oh, this will be a shower again. Let's see. Oh, wow, that's a shower. Oh, no, this is your door. toilet. <laughs> okay, so your door will go right up to there. Keep oh, so Mazzy out. Tissues. You can sit down there with a beer, have a good time. Love it. Oh, so this is a shower as well. Is it? I think this is your shower as well. Yeah, it must be. It's got a double sink at the bottom. Go on, let's let her back in. Oh, she's in the kitchen. <laughs> Leave her in there. Uh, I usually am. This is a bit strange. You've got your fridge next to the bed. Not sure what I think of that. I want to know what this is. So What's you push. That? So you push the button here. Yeah. Now what happens? You go like that. And then you say, why have you broke it? I don't know, I'm guessing a table comes out of the back of there or something, but I don't know how to use it, because as I say, we haven't got the code, Mazzy, because we haven't got this kind of money. I do like this colour scheme. It's it very is. nice, isn't it? It's bright, airy, clean. Beautiful vans. Yeah. Quality. Definitely quality with the Cafargos. Is that how, am I saying that right? Cafargo? Never know. Cafargo, I think. Cafargo. Right, let's move on. I want to see if they've got a cheaper one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, run out of Cathargos. Eco VIP. Never heard of these before. Laika. Don't know which country these are from. Never heard of them. So £79,000. Brand new. Far birth. 
It's quite a high one, 2.96, but it's quite it's, tall, uh, isn't it? overhead, isn't it? Right, let's have a look. I've never heard of this uh, make before, so I'm interested. Right, I don't okay. like that. What don't you like? This, it looks very cheap and tacky. It's actually paper mirror instead of a real mirror. I don't feel I like the chairs either. I like the colour, but the quality just... I don't know, for this kind of money, I expected a bit more... There's things I'm liking, but there's yeah. things I'm not liking, like this. I'm guessing your TV goes on there. Oh, cool. Oh, oh you'd damage like that, it. wouldn't you? You'd... I wouldn't. <laughs> very nice... Uh... Oh, my lighting isn't working very t good today. Lovely control panel up here. Oh. Yeah, dark wood. I've never been a fan of dark wood. It does darken the place, doesn't it? So it looks like there's a lot of lockers, but actually they're not very deep. You know, yeah. you wouldn't really get... It's not even the length of my hand. You wouldn't get a lot in there. What about the throne? Let's have a look in the throne. There it is. I'd like someone to design a nice looking one. You know, they all, they're all exactly the same standard. Lovely big mirror. So it's a shower toilet. I do like these. I think they look nice. I do like the look of the colours and uh, the, the wood effect and that, but I do feel it would be a bit dark. Yeah. Do you know dark. what I mean? Like in my kitchen now, yeah. this is all too dark. Especially when it's got an overhead bed. Yeah. You'd want an. You, you'd want your sunlight. Yeah. Here, would, is and I'll tell you, a sunroof. Sunroof. Kind of thing. You'd want Skylight. the other one to keep it bright, and it doesn't work with this overhead. Because on a um, oh, on, nice. on a no look. No, no, I'm on about. Oh, the, the sink. sink. Very deep. Oh, that's really, really nice. nice. I was gonna say that's a bit. Yeah, oh, you'd be surprised on a dull day if you haven't got a lot of windows. These do get dull inside, don't they? Yes, they do, especially in winter. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, oh. yeah, different company. Never seen them before. Quite unusual, and I do like the fact you've got a chair there. It's where you used to having a double one there, a big long one. I like just a single. Yeah. So Mazzy couldn't sit next to me, she would have to sit there. <laughs> You're cheeky. But again, an incredibly big boot. Oh, I'm loving this now. Are these all drawers? No, oh no. For your electric yeah. Ones. Yeah. Look, this is good though. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, we could have one put in and has it quite easily. Could we? By someone who knows what they're doing, which isn't me. <laughs> <laughs> very nice. Yeah, very nice. Moving on. Yeah. One problem we're having today. Yeah, what's that? We can't remember which ones we've already reviewed. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we don't know which we've been in and which we haven't. So, so. we repeat ourselves, please excuse us. <laughs> we might have a different opinion today. <laughs> we showed some which you could hire yesterday. Yeah. Which yeah. were £700 for the week. I uh, can't remember now. I think so. <laughs> that was like a Jeep. Um, oh, yeah. These yeah. are camper vans for hire for a very similar price, £99, from £99 a day. Well, they're very... nice, aren't they? Oh, yeah. But I, I, there's one problem with hiring for me. What's Although that? I always recommend it before buying, I just know what me and you are like. We'd spill a cup of coffee and stuff, wouldn't we? Oh, we'd destroy it, Mazzy. <laughs> yeah. No one would ever lend us anything to use for <laughs> any yeah. amount of time. I would be nervous, and the more nervous I was, the more I'm going to spill. I'm going to be like that. <laughs> no, if we hired this, for example, we would have to buy it at the end of the week because we'd yeah. destroy it. <laughs> yeah. But th it's very nice, isn't it? It is. It is. Yeah. No, no, no. There's another one there, a charcoal coloured one. And the skin North Star. I do like this one. They are actually. nice. Yeah. Oh, very nice. Very compact, aren't they? You wouldn't have trouble getting into a supermarket or anything with these. Lovely. I thought we'd try something a bit different. Yes. Um, caravan. 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 <laughs> Anybody? And it's for homes as well. Homes. Statics. Caravans, statics, motorhomes, whatever you like. You can get in touch with this company. 
And refurb, get it all up upholstered. Uh, Choose whatever you want, reupholster your, your van, yeah. your waterfall, the curtains, the flooring, the vinyl and flooring, the little carpet. It's something we would consider one day, isn't it? Maybe changing our seat covers to nice ones. And I would love, love a carpet in our van as well. Well, yeah. yeah. You know, when they start Fit to look it. tired after a few years. Well, they are looking tired. <laughs> <laughs> the beauty about a company like this is you can basically pick anything you want. Yeah, yeah, I like it. Like here, look, you've got uh, yeah, some seats here, so you can imagine this in the motorhome. Yeah. You've got all these different ones to choose from. Okay, yeah. do you know how big the seats in here is at the back? That's lovely, isn't it? So I'll just show See, you them. Just like a double again, same as the front doors. Yeah, it's no, it's the Caravan on Facebook. Yeah. There's the uh, website. Yeah. If anyone's interested, yeah. check them out. So okay. I can't imagine there's very many companies doing this. So, okay, so you got your front, your two fronts. Right, we've come across a lovely little girl called Bo. <laughs> <laughs> Giggling away here, it's a birthday coming up. How old are you going to be, Bo? Seven. Seven. And she's going to be at the show we're at next weekend, so we mm -hmm. might see her again because they're there for three days and so are we. Yeah. <laughs> she, how, where are her favourite uh, YouTubers apparently? She's having a birthday party tomorrow. Tell everyone what you're doing. Um, I'm going to have a birthday bear picnic. A teddy bear picnic. A Builder Bear picnic, which is a teddy bear. A Builder Bear, I know what they are. Builder they're, Bear. They're brilliant. Fantastic. <laughs> and we might get I think that is the first child we've actually spoke to on this three days. We haven't seen any other children, no. have we? No, so you're lucky. And we have got permission from the parents, so don't be saying anything in the comments. <laughs> Lovely to meet you, Bo. Oh, See you all later. Bye bye. Bye bye. Take care. Hello. Sweetest possible. Okay, this is unique, something I've never seen before. A lead sandwich. Have you got a noisy generator? Well, here's your answer. <laughs> That's incredible. They're lovely, isn't they? Yeah, so light. I just want you to feel how light they were. Keep your generators quiet. I like that. <laughs> Sorry about that. What you do, you've got three things going on with this. We inject in the, the scene into the tyre, okay? Once it's in there, it coats the inside tread area. Yeah. What first? The seed that we put in. We put seed that coats the inside tread area here. Okay. 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 Once it's in there, that combats the porousness of your tyre. Yeah. Your tyres are porous, so it's always deflating. So you've always got to keep going and, and putting air back into your tyre. Yeah. Especially when you're, you've left it on storage for a while. Yeah. You know, six months or whatever, you go back. Most people just jump in it and drive it, think they're okay. But what you should do is check your pressures because you're running underinflated. That's damaging your tire straight away. This stops that happening. It maintains a correct pressure. Okay. When you're driving along, because you've got the scene in and you've got a little bit of residue hanging around in there waiting to do its job. Yeah. What it does, it runs cooler. On average, 10 degrees cooler than what a tire without the, the scene in yeah. run. That's going to give you better wear out your tire, up to 20%. And it gives you better fuel consumption because oh. it, it, it's running a little better. Okay. The third and most important thing: if you run over something, oh, good lord! <laughs> right. Or some well, that's going to make a right racket every time I go around. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> but what this does, as it comes out, it seals it instantly. Wow. I'll tell you what, we are, well I, and I've said this just the other day, always panicking because we haven't got a spare tyre and we haven't even got a puncture foam at the moment. That's funny because you've mentioned it quite a lot this week. To I'm me, terrified of getting a puncture. Yeah. We have just replaced our tyres, so they're pretty new in the last couple of few months, aren't they? So they're new in the last few months? No, no, no. Tires. No. no. Island, Island six, was about six November. Month, eight months. Yeah, but that's, yeah. that's okay. okay. It's going to make it last longer. It doesn't matter how many times. That looks fun. Incredible. <laughs> Do you want to go? <laughs> okay, go We're going to get this done. Are they all in there? Yeah, they're, they're all holes. Are you filming me? Yeah. I can hear it. Spin it. It stopped, Mazzy. It stopped. Go on, do stab, 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 stab. <laughs> wow! That's 
<laughs> very impressed. Yeah, very impressed. I've never even heard of this. Never heard of it. Puncture control, tyre sealant. We're getting it done. So all you guys who haven't got a spare tyre in your motor homes like we haven't, this is the thing you need. So there you have it. Yes. The end of us first motor home show of the year. Hope you enjoyed it as much as we did. We, we certainly loved it. did, didn't we? I think yeah. we've got four videos for you there, so we'll go back and check the other ones. Yep. <laughs> um, accessories, camper vans, motorhomes, and God knows what this one is. A bit of everything, <laughs> of course. <laughs> uh, join us for us vlogs coming up this week. Make sure you subscribe, yes. by the way, if you're new. Yep. Um, we've got plenty of vlogs coming up. We've got a couple of reviews coming up. Uh, we're off on to another campsite now, yes. and then we're off on to another show next week, so... Looking forward to that. Check that one out with us. Yeah. It's slightly different to this. Uh, I think we're going to have some really cool things to film there, so... Yeah. Anyway, we're exhausted. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just leave us alone, let us have a rest. Yeah. Bye. Bye-bye.